what is up everybody my name is Tony and I'm here with another Warframe guide video in this video we will be looking at the Prisma Tetra so I got two builds for you guys the first build will be the ribbon version Now this ribbon is actually pretty nice it's actually pretty OP as well but when it comes to the weapons functionality it's not that well ideal to use this in high levels because well first off is this weapon does pretty little damage when it comes to the crits it's not that good in crits but when it comes to getting a ribbon for crits, you get a 41%, well, for my ribbon, of course. I mean, with 160 critical chance and 150 critical chance, I mean, I only got 41%. So that's a downside to this weapon. Hates crits, but absolutely is decent in status chance. So I do have two status types here with viral and heat. You guys can swap this out for corrosive and whatever. For those that do not have a ribbon, this is what it looks like. Now, usually when you guys are using this Prisma Tetra, it is recommended to use this with mag if you guys do not have a beam weapon or any strong ass weapon at all. Because what happens is if you guys use the kinetic ricochet, it basically bounces inside a little ball thing and it basically deals a crap load of damage. It's not really good. I mean, it's just not the best weapon to use for mag when it comes to this type of playstyle for mag, but it's like a decent set up here but you guys can see that these guys are level 180 viral heat procs and these guys are taking a lot of damage here for those that do not use mag well you guys just shoot at the body shots here this is what it looks like with the damage output it's pretty weak on body shots but what about the headshots though they missed a few headshots but it's not that well it's decent enough i would say but that's just the look of it though here is the second build now keep in mind i do have vigilante supplies on this because i cannot fit my focus acceleration mod on here and i highly recommend getting focus acceleration because it just increases the projectiles by a lot but if you guys don't want that you guys can use vigilante supplies if you guys want or if you guys are planning to use the kinetic ricochet you guys can use that as well for mag but when it comes to this build it's pretty decent headshots body shots everywhere and for those that wants to know if this weapon works well or this build works well in mag without a ribbon here it is what it look like let's cast the number two there and this is what it looks like on that not that great so i do recommend a ribbon if you guys are planning to make this weapon strong but again it's pretty decent though and that is it for this video if you guys enjoyed this video give it a like subscribe to support my channel thank you guys for watching until next time you guys peace out